Gemini, how's it going? Welcome to Told Us Love Tarot. If this is your first time here, thanks for stopping by. I hope you subscribe. Um, if you're returning, thanks again for coming by. I hope it's because you've subscribed. Um, this is for Gemini placements, Sun, Moon, Rising, um, and Venus, or if you have heavy Gemini in your chart. Also, if you are a Gemini born June 17th through the 20th, you might want to check out my Gemini Cancer cusp readings. There could be something in there for you. Um, I just got a terrible cramp in a part of my thigh that I've never gotten a cramp before. And I had to stop the Gemini reading that I had started, get up, walk around. I always try to relate what's going on to what's like who I'm about to read for. So if there's someone who's like dealing with like leg cramps, please let me know because this is like a place I've never gotten a cramp before. Or I was thinking like someone's Gemini is just feeling like their age I'm hearing maybe. Um, I also got Gemini this feeling like you're, you're a boss or the boss. I was seeing like Tony Soprano with a cigar, like exhaling, like there's a Gemini and Gemini placement who um, is just feeling really good about themselves. It might be physically, mentally, emotionally. I'm hearing just a boss status. Even if you have like shit going on around you, you're still acting like a boss or you're still the boss. My face must look awesome when <laughs> that happened. There was like way too many cards, like a chunk of them fell out. Oh, well, there we are. Gemini, Queen of Swords, upright. King of Cups, reverse. Queen of Swords, air energy. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. And then King of Cups is water energy. Um, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Got Aquarius right here. And we have the world. For whatever reason, I felt like um, Gemini. This is like someone who's been <clears throat> made someone's world or is someone's world and someone does not like the pressure of I'm also feeling heavily like someone saying someone saying one thing but feeling another. I'm hearing and seeing like the world sees one thing but they're feeling another and it's like not happy. It's not good. It's like an imbalanced with the star reversed here and then the five of cups reversed it's and then the five of swords i was thinking like someone's dealing with some emotional and mental um wounds maybe trauma looking at the way that they communicate and love way that they've been doing things up to this point I'm getting like looking at 
how the world views you, like your communication. Worrying about how the world views you. I feel like this is a Gemini who's had a side of them that's been hidden for a while that they're bringing out to the world and they're worried about how this is going to be received and how it's going to be looked at. Will it be lovingly received or will people turn their back to me? I don't know why I'm, I hear like upside that's been hidden. This person's hiding this. It's like it was always kind of there shining through, but now they're taking down those those wands that were hiding any sort of um I don't know how to describe this. It's like it was obvious all along that this person was either different or this could be you, Gemini, or someone else, that this person was different and had um, this side of them that kind of showed, but now it's like time to reveal, to show this to the world. Or now it's time to share this side of me. Maybe someone has some like bigger issues that they haven't shown or discussed with their partner or who you're talking to, who you're connected to. I'm even thinking like this could be work related. Someone hasn't communicated what your inner battles have been and now it's like finally being communicated the things that you're dealing with mentally and emotionally i just see like a <coughs> like coughing out something maybe someone said like cough it up what's that term cough it out come on it's like getting someone to confess something Maybe you got someone to confess something or they got you to confess something, but it's not like it wasn't hidden or wasn't viewed or seen, but it was never really talked about. Yeah, heavy, like it wasn't talked about. And it has to do with someone's issues. They made it work for them, I'm hearing, like their issues. They made it work for them for some reason. Um being smart with how they like worded things or like would get away with things. Ooh, King of Swords, holy moly. Well, that's <clears throat> Air Energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Two of Cups, <clears throat> you know the King of Swords in this deck is there with the Queen of Swords from the other deck. And the King and Queen, we all have masculine and feminine energy in us. And when we're in tune with both sides and feeling safe and healthy with both sides, there becomes this like healthy duality, this healthy feeling of one. <clears throat> and I saw this as those two sides of Gemini, or you literally could be talking to someone else who's an air sign or dealing with someone who's an air sign. But I just saw like the two halves of this Gemini coming together as like someone's working on letting go of toxic, um, I feel like, I hate the word I hate to just use the word toxic, but unhealthy, ad addictive type emotions 
attachment emotions that were very unhealthy. Working on healing. Um, I just heard like working on healing why you wanted to hide um, so much of yourself. Or hide half of yourself to begin with because <clears throat> maybe this is part of the Gemini that was out there and this is part of the Gemini that was hidden and now they're coming together and they're coming out maybe this is a Gemini who's coming out as um, I feel like maybe having two sides of them maybe someone's bisexual maybe someone's I'm just hearing like there's two sides to this Gemini. So maybe they're identifying as having this like really dominant macho side of them, but they also have this other side and maybe person inside them that is a <clears throat> female. So it's like there's a, um, someone who's just two sides of them have come together the best way I could describe this is like for myself being a Gemini I'm thinking the Megan and the Gemini Meg and it's like this side of me that is the Gemini Meg in astrology and tarot and then the Megan who works um every work that work week who works who does laundry and the dishes and cooks and had to just shovel this morning that's Megan but the two parts of me have come together I say boss I was gonna say this is a Gemini who's like done a lot of healing especially with that three of swords reverse coming out done a lot of healing because that's why you're able to come back together you've done a lot of personal healing and you're like showing the world I feel like the work you've put in to like make yourself The hermit is here. You could be dealing with the Virgo. Knight of Swords, Six of Swords reversed, and Knight of Pentacles upright. <clears throat> I just heard like not in a rush to communicate the gains or the things that you've done to work on yourself. You're keeping things, the healing that you've done as much as you can to yourself. You're staying to yourself. Um, people may one, I'm here like people may envy where you're at right now and like this inner peace, whether they communicate it or not. You're like, you're, you're solid right now, Gemini. Two halves of you are like working together. There's healing going on here. I feel like you've done it on your own too. Putting to rest old ways of communication and, um, Something again with mental health, working on a mental and emotional health. And in the end, you're coming out like a head. It's like a transformation I'm seeing too. The death card isn't here. I'm like, oh my gosh, if it was there, I was going to like, it's not here. I'm not going to go looking for it. But the moon, that's cancer energy. Um. 
I see like a Gemini who's got who's offering up to the world or beginning to really focus on something that maybe that was hidden that they kept hidden this could be a side of them that most didn't know about and um it's like time for this Gemini to come forth and show this other side of them and it's I see a very confident boss, Gemini. I'm going to end it there, Gemini. I hope something in here resonated for you. If it doesn't, I would check out my other signs in my birth chart. Um, I hope everyone is safe, well, and I will see you next time. Bye.